Hi guys, today we are going to see soft starter. Actually, what's the purpose of soft starter? Actually, AC machine having a some inverse current. That means at the time of starting, current what happen? Four to six times of full load current occurred. So this is going to damage the AC machines, insulations, and winding. So that's the purpose of we need to do some special things to reduce this. Six, five to four to six times a uh, full load current. So that's why we use for soft starter. So soft starter, what are the functions are in this section? Just a minute. Before that, what are the alternative methods have available in soft without soft starter? First one is star delta starter. So this is also used to reduce <coughs> starting current. Then voltage changing method. That means by using auto transformer to changing the voltage. And third one is we change VFD. Actually, VFD we use for speed control. This is used to inverse current reduce reduction also. So now we are going to use for most advanced system of soft software. Just a minute. Now, now I take soft starter for ABB PST series. Oh, this is for common for all PST series. So now I show you for some power, <coughs> some power drawing of PST soft starter. Just for this side, I show you for power drawing. We got for three phase supply. So here we use for some <coughs> MCC bill like that. Incoming supply. After that. We use some conductor, C conductor. After that, we put soft starter. After that, only we give on to AC machine. So this is for simple power drying of soft starter. After that, we make the control dying of stopped sub starter just before that i terminating the all the terminals of sub starter are here just see actually avp pst having a some more key sun for controlling purpose first of all we giving a accelerator supply AU supply phase and IX supply neutral. <coughs> After that, we having a six nine relays on here. Sorry, three relays on here. First one is fault relay. Second one is run relay. Third one is ready. So these three relays are available here. These three relays having a common N one and C. So these are the terminals are available here. After that, maybe terminal uh, eight or nine, eight and nine, and then eleven. So here we need to short the eight or nine, and then after that we use it to start, start or stop by using this push button. So here. This is for simple remote control to control the soft starter. So now I make some special 
some special control by using angular relays so here we put two relays first one is r2 and second one is r1 so here we put these two relays <coughs> after that we draw the control diagram here just see this is for fuse and then we make stop push button on here and then start push button after that we make R2 NC and after that we make R1 coil so this is for A1 and A2 actually supply this is for phase and neutral maybe whatever you have a uh, uh, auxiliary voltage that we are we have to arrange on here auxiliary voltage of VFT after that we mix for continuous running R1 N N1 here after that we make R1 for indication that means running indication we put running indication may be green so here R1 after that for tripping tripping indication on we put R2 on here for tripping we put red so now after that we make here we make fault relay to make R2 R2 on neutral so this is a very simple method to we make control drawing of VFD sorry soft starter uh, if you have any doubt please come on here this is a very simple method I just explained for simple method if you have any need to act, activate some other special functions you, we need to modification make release and then this is a very simple method before that I forgot one, one thing in here this is from C1 conductor R1 so if we start on here we start we push the start button after that we got R1 is energized then the R1 NC is closed to N NC sorry R1 NY is closed to NC that's why we got always R1 is energized at the time this R1 and this one and this one the three R1 coils are energized to close so this one is closed the C1 connector is energized so this T1 connector is energized to giving a supply to soft starter after that giving a supply to motor and then here another one R1 is closed that time the green LED is glowed sorry green lamp is glowed for running symbol and then this R1 is closed so that's why the soft starter will be activated then only we got output output from soft starter to motor suppose we got any any tripping fault on here then this R2 relays activated at the time this R2 NC coil is opened so the soft starter stop giving a block to motor supply then another thing here also we have R2 so this is also open so these are the, all the R1 coils are open then R2 coil is closed on to here your tripping signal will be showed in output of the panel that's all guys if you have any doubt please comment here Thank you very much.